We begin with a family owned golf course forced to beef up its security after being repeatedly hit by vandals and thieves. That family says in all of its years of owning the course, nothing like this has ever happened. All happening at the Bellow Woods Golf Course. That's at 23 Mile and North in Macomb Township, and that's where Victor Williams is right now. Victor, we're talking more than $10,000 in damage. Yes, that is correct, Devin. A lot of damage and that along with the theft and vandalism that has occurred right here at this golf course has been a lot on management. They're telling me that this is a place that's supposed to be enjoyed and not destroyed. People just have um, no respect for a lot of things going on these days. Bella Woods co-owner Janet Schrotty has been in charge of the 52 year old family golf course for quite some time, but says she never had to deal with anything as bad as what's been going on this year. Back in March, someone apparently broke into one of the outhouses, causing about $4,000 in damage with some type of metal pole. They just banged the doors in and broke all the fixtures. That's where it started. The folks who do come here and, 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 and golf, they love it here. So I, I really don't understand how they can really just do this kind of stuff. The damage was believed to be the end of it until other equipment started to seemingly disappear in October and November. Next thing you know, fall comes along and we have now we have two carts missing. Not just any old cart, two high end golf carts priced at $3,000 each, creating a major setback for the facility. And we're talking about probably a total between these three things, $12,000. And even with all the issues that have happened, the main thing manager Kathleen Crackiola desires is peace of mind. We'd love it they, if they could even come clean or just stop doing it, uh, maybe bring the carts back. Just consider how hard we work and I wouldn't come over and, you know, do anything to your property. So, you know, leave my property here the way you found it. And Janet doesn't believe that this is the result of someone having a bone to pick with the business, but instead the result of outsiders who may have just moved into the community that might have a lack of respect. I'm a Township, Victor Williams, Local 4. That's right. All right, Victor.